Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Mixstar, and this is Have Dimension Neptunia Rebirth Ray. As you just said, Victory Generation. And yeah, this is the third game that I'm gonna be playing in the Neptunia series. And yeah, I had to do that because it it's still doing that complete rotation around when, when I start, which is kind of pointless. I thought unplugging my keyboard would actually work, but it didn't work. So I was just going to have to... I'm going to have to deal with a keyboard. I don't like a keyboard. Throw a joypad. But, yeah. I'm going to be playing this until I complete it. And I hope you all enjoy. So, let's get to it. All my DLC. It's Game industry. A land over which CPUs rule and game mascots rally under them, uh, away from the realm of humans. Game no. industry is made up of four nations, each ruled over by one of the CPUs. Yeah, but the CPUs are there. CPU Whiteheart rules Louis. CPU Blackheart. Rules last station. CPU Greenheart rules lean box. And yeah. CPU Purple Heart rules Planetune. I like that pause. <laughs> Each nation battles over dominion of the land, with the CPUs keeping one another in top form, creating a balance. Really? Memories of the battle against the deity of sin and her schemes remain fresh in game industry's mind. It was moments. The four nations banded together and managed to thwart her ambitions. Some time had passed. And game industry had once again returned to a peaceful way of life. Yay, peace! That peace did not last long. Uh oh. The curtains rise on the four CPUs, who are about to trigger a new war. Again, another one. Don't let you have your frickin' way. I hope you can entertain me a little bit at least. You should feel honored to be able to face me. All right, I'll play with you for a minute. Come and get it. I'm gonna go all out. Yeah, the like always is always free on one. Won't we'll sail up, but never do it. Today. Huh? This. Take this. Huh? It's over. You're mine. I'll finish this. I won't lose. <laughs> this is where you shall perish. Disappear. Huh? Ow. Go, Neptune. It is high time you receive your comeuppance, Purple Heart. No, Neptune. How careless of me to think the three of you would join forces. Oh, come on. It only makes sense at this point to lower the head count one at a time like this. It'd be a pain if you end up being the last one standing. So we're gonna beat you down first. If only Nepgear were here, I shouldn't have abandoned her. A bit late for regrets now. Get ready to die! Please rest assured, Neptune. We won't torture you. Expect a swift and clean death. 
Então vamos embora. Leave the finishing blow for me. I'll never lose. Even against the three of you, I will be victorious. Yeah. It's free on Your one. life will be taken by my hands. Hmm, so yeah, it's the same controls, right? So K L I O. So Aw. Don't get my EX gauge. EX skill. Hmm. Don't Fuck get you. in our way! Just it all! Stop it! Ready whenever! I'm ready anytime! Are you ready? I'll finish this in one go! Uh, that's not gonna work! Don't get in our way! Stop it! I'll end this! Are you ready? I will have you perish here! No! They get it! They get theirs! And I'm dead. I'll finish this in one go. Oh, wait. Seriously, I've got that much health. I didn't know this. Yeah, but I ain't gonna win this. Don't get in our way. Stop it. Stop it. Not bad. This is the true strength of Last Station CPU. So is this just made for a demonstration of each of the EX skills? Oh. I don't know. You prepared? Nothing can survive against my super dreadnought class strength! <laughs> yeah, I don't think anyone wants to face it. Over one. I'm the main character. Hi, Neptune. N no, this cannot be. Is this where I finally die? No, not really. But I have to sort that out. It can't be. <sighs> oh, that was purple. No, I lost you guys. Oh, it was only a game. <laughs> One down, two to go. Victory is all but mine. <laughs> I like the fact that it was a game. Keep real. With Neptune out of the game, none of you stand a chance against me. Hey! Come on. It sucks when you all gang up on me just because I'm awesome. You're all cheater belly eaters. <laughs> what a rude accusation to make. We all inadvertently have the same goal in mind. Uh... Yeah, take out one and before go off to the others. Times like this should give you a glimpse into who you are as a person and how you act in your daily life. Okay. Aw, I really wanted to play too. I'm as sorry as a cat, Nep Jr. It's a four-player game, so... You received your comeuppance for barging in when it was your sister's turn. Yeah. Just a second. I'll win this round real quick. <laughs> okay, one more game. If I let you all win every time, it'll make Planet Tune's CPU look like a loser. Uh, do I even want to go there? Round two, fight! Not initiating. What is this buggy scream? Ooh. Scream bug. Only Purple Heart is showing up. None of ours are even loading. Neptune, did you break the game? Ow! You did nothing. I did nothing of the sort. I selected my titular character and pushed the start button like always. <laughs> then it's a freeze bug, no? I had this game myself, but I've never had this happen to me. 
and the place it loaded your character into. It looks like a dungeon, doesn't it? <laughs> now that you mention it, it does. Why would there be data for a dungeon in a fighting game? Hmm. Perhaps the developers reused an old engine and the assets were left in. Or an update file was installed? I don't know. Neptune, can you control your character at all? I've been mashing all the buttons the whole time you've been talking, but uh, she's stuck. <laughs> Learn meshing. I see. As a gamer, I would love to explore this restricted area. But at this rate... Oh, if that's all it is, then I have the perfect gizmo to help. <laughs> Let's get to the rescue. My special head-mounted super full-dive immersive controller! I call it the Nebulous Grift, Tim. Oh, basically a VR headset. A controller you wear on your head? It looks like any other VR headset. What's different about this one? <laughs> Could this be the device that we have all dreamed of? Does it allow you to dive into a game by wearing it? Yes! Game industry journalist recommended a young adult novel about online game worlds to me. I had to try. <laughs> and since the controller doesn't have its own software, I made a universal dongle to let it work with any device. Ooh. And yet no one impl implements that. Um, long story short, we can use it to intervene in the game, whether it's bugged or frozen or anything really. Ooh. I would love a device like that. <laughs> Neptune, since when has your sister been this much of a machine-loving and tinkerer character? Since always! She loved gadgets and gizmos. But then again, he wasn't around much in the second one, so... We don't really know much about her. Neptune's machine fetish was innocent enough that it didn't get in the way of her cuteness. How'd it end up this way? <laughs> Wait! Is it because of the new route they added into Rebirth 2, where she and Uni worked on a machine together? <laughs> Is it this entire subplot based on that one route where her tinkering really took off? Damn, she's doing that. I know I've just played it, but... But anyway, they said it was a sub-route. I only went for the main story. Here, may I please use that device to dive into this game? Um, well, <laughs> I just finished development on it this morning. It's <laughs> untested, so I don't think anyone can use it. But, why did you bring it up if it's not tested yet? I see. In that case... <gasps> oh, I see what's going on now. <laughs> yep. You said it hasn't been tested, but you brought it out anyway. So, what do you think was going to happen? As Purple Heart is shown on screen, I believe Neptune standing as the protagonist will keep her safe. <laughs> protagonist shield! Go! <laughs> the logic of a gamer. Yeah. Don't blame me if something happens. Let me see. Is this the headset start button? And push. <laughs> hey, hey, hey! What sort of situational comedy situation have you situated me in, Vert? <laughs> and Neptune is Purple Heart. But uh, this could be a cool thing to experience. <laughs> so this is what it's like to be inside a game, huh? Dive success. Goodness. Still, what a ridiculous scenario. She <laughs> looks like her HDD form, but her personality and voice is Neptune. <laughs> yeah. Oh, you're right. 
Whoa! Is this my body after transforming? <laughs> I never noticed. <laughs> well, you never look down. So of course you'll never notice. <laughs> this is too weird. Neptune, can you just act like your HDD self for me? Aww, it's fun this way! I don't know if I can or not, but I'll give it a try, try, passerby! No, oh, it's more fun this way! How does this sound? No. I figured there was nothing to lose by asking, but I never thought you'd manage to pull it off. <laughs> yeah, kind of a letdown, though. Okay, this feels more natural. Neptune, can you move around? As you can see, my movement is not restricted in the slightest. Neptunior, I am impressed. This feels real. Oh, golly! My big sister praised me! <laughs> Yay! <laughs> oh, I just like that a little bit. Yay! Well, seriously, I want this device. So we'll make it. However... Remaining in this form and using this personality is quite tiresome. Oh, oh, snappy snap. It's way more comfy to laze about in this bod. So you can transform back in the in the game? What? You changed back somehow! I don't see how. Of course she did. This fighting game has an HDD transformation system as one of its mechanics. Oh. So then, basically, it's obvious. Anything is possible in games. <coughs> True. Well, now that I'm back to my usual carefree self, let's start this investigation free of cares. It's D. Don't want these. You already know everything I'm doing. And I think everyone else knows as well. Wow. Ooh, look at the dungeon. Yep, and it's the same keys to move the camera around. Which is the number section. Or whatever. <laughs> oh, and that too. Boing. Hmm. Item. Found an item. Yay! Ooh, achievement. Right, get both. Chestbuster! Yeah! Ooh! Whoop! I'm fine. Just easy, peasy, peasy. Hmm, I don't know why, but I should just check to see if I've go. got any other I'm items fine. and stuff. Okay, I have items, but what about weapons? Hmm. Ooh, and I like the layout. No, I don't have any weapons. Ah. Just gotta keep remembering that. Oh, is it? I don't get access to them because this is within the game. Yeah, and I'm not going to start the game at level 50. <clears throat> so, yeah, I'm not going to get access to the DLC content right now. It's a hand. You only saw my after image. Ah, come on, don't do that. There you go. Chestbuster! Hey! Ha ha bye! There we go. Hmm. <laughs> and yeah. Yep, that's one. Oh, so they did still keep it in there? I thought they actually got rid of that. At one point. Yeah. Oh, I guess I was wrong. And this is a dungeon I only get to access once for the whole game. Found an item. 
Okay. So, let's go endpoint there. And, so we've got, it's basically got two events on the screen. Seriously, you guys, what's up with this place? It's a bugged area, isn't it? Either that or it's a different game's dungeon assets mixed in. Hmm. Do you think? Something's buggering me, though. What? Be careful, Neptune! Something's coming your way! My way? But there can't be anything here other than my fine self. Have you seen all the monsters around? Uh... <gasps> it's a succulent beast! What is this thing? Was this ever in one of our games? No. No such monster exists in the Neptunia franchise. An irregular existence. Either it's a bug or some kind of virus in the game's code. Well, it's in there now. Virus? I suppose it's possible. Maybe the area Neptune's exploring was made by that same virus then. Mm. It is a tad hasty to jump to that conclusion. But the enemy is intent on fighting, so shall it be. <laughs> Uh, hang on! We don't even know what this thing is! Can I even beat it? Yes, you're level 50! You're in a game! It'll be fine! Yeah, you game characters within the game... ...in the game. Why that... are you acting so casual and vague now, of all times? If I lose, I might seriously die! Die in the game, die in real life! That kind of horror premise exists! I think if you die in a dream, you die in real life is what people said. I don't know. I don't know if that is true, but it's what people said anyway. Oh, oh! Maybe if you fight it, I can extract some really neato combat data from the game's code! <laughs> okay, Neptune, go fight it. I'm interested. Perfect. <laughs> Are you gabbing gals even listening? Are you lippy ladies ignoring me? Can't you flippin' females hear me? Uh, yeah, they can do all that, but they say, go fight it. Okie dokie. I've connected my end gear to the headset. I should be able to extract the enemy's data now. <laughs> yep, that guy's not listening at all. You heard the plan, Neptune. Get fighting. Go. <laughs> go! Fine. I'm gonna use my attack spamming suicide strategy. Don't call it a suicide strategy. Yeah, don't know what is from all the other games. They're coming from above! Huh, third time for that joke, huh? That one I thought, that one I thought. That one. Yeah, I thought that, haven't it? They're not new. Kill the bug spider. Chest Buster! Here you go! A complete <laughs> and utter victory! Oh, that was easier than eating. <laughs> it's worth it to try stuff out. Did you get your data, Neptunior? Yes! It went perfect thanks to you! Hmm. So this is the data structure they used? Hmm. <laughs> what the goodness? What is the what? matter, Nepgear? Is the data corrupt? No, no. The data is perfectly fine. And I've analyzed it without issue. But, um... Well, this is... What is it, girl? Speak up! Gah, annoying! Just spit it out already! Your opponent is a sentient virus. So... Skynet. When you say virus, you speak of the computer kind and not an illness, yes? Right. I don't know why it exists, but I'm positive it's behind the reason why our game got messed up. So yeah, as I said, Skynet. The virus seems to have built this dungeon area via a network connection. I read 
said something similar to this in a book years ago. <laughs> years ago. Crazy cakes. You're telling me that it's the virus's fault that my sweet battling CPU's game got all buggy? Expect no forgiveness. <laughs> no forgiveness of virus. Legitimately angry for once. Well, obviously, a virus has bugged the game. What do you expect? Well, duh. I scrimped and saved my measly allowance for many moons to buy the game and console, so this sucks. <laughs> Your allowance? <laughs> yeah, you think she wouldn't get one? If Neptune has uncontrolled access to money, she buys every game she sees. So Isty put her on an allowance. Oh! If Neptune's a child! She's treated like a child! Planetune CPUs are so weird. Hey! I think Neptune is fine. Neptune is fine. Neptune isn't. Quarantine thing and delete them all. Any more baddies around, Nep Junior? I'm scanning the data, and I'm seeing a lot in the vicinity. But I mean a lot. This might be tough, even for you. Numbers aren't important to me. A CPU won't bend or break against some dinky dingus of a virus. <laughs> If she had this drive all the time, Istuar probably wouldn't get so many stomach ulcers from the stress. <laughs> Wait, my end gear is reacting. Anyway, does she get stomach ulcers? What is it this time? One super strong reaction came through the far end of the dungeon area. Maybe it's the root of the virus. Hey, okay, let's go kick its ass. Nicely analyzed, my tech. Savvy tinkerer of a sister, I'm gonna vent all my rage onto them for breaking my game. Yeah, you go do that. Oh, first item. Ooh, looks neat. Enjoy playtime and lifetime. <laughs> Uh, yeah, good gamble. Here you go! Here you go! A complete and utter victory! <laughs> Alright. And the camera. Mm. Anything? Ah, uh, something there. Give me that. My after image. And the kick your butt. Chest Buster! Bye bye! Yeah. A complete and utter. Surprise attack and success! Aww. Now we've got to deal, deal with four. Yeah! Just it's all over. Oh! I'm fine. Don't do that. Stop it! And then. A complete and Goodbye, bugs. Hmm. Yeah, just quickly save it here first. Even though first area, I'm already level 50. Should be easy. Ah! No. Wait. What was that I just... Press defend. You stop it. Hey! Hey! 
Hey! What? Rude. Hey, bye bye. Bye, bud. Huh? Here you go! Hey! What? what the hell? What have I done? So, my new duds look awesome on me, right? But, uh, they didn't have any shoes my size, so they're my old ones. Boing! <laughs> uh, what the hell is going on? Alrighty, I'll do my best. What? What? Do to this. Yeah. Hey. Hey. What? What? Here it's all over. Victory. All right, something is wrong with us. Oh, now you're working again. For some reason, I couldn't. That's why. Oh, oh. <laughs> you keep destroying servants. Are you the virus? <laughs> Excellent response. At this rate, my objective will soon be achieved. Why are you here anyway? I found you, virus leader thing. I'm not gonna let you bug up my awesome game a second longer. Who's there? Ask, and thou shall receive it. I am the guardian CPU of Planetune, known as Neptune. Prepare thyself. Good. Ah, a CPU? You're the mean bean machine that screwed up my beloved game. Forgiveness is all sold out today. <laughs> yeah. Why is a CPU in this place? We're inside of a game right now! Huh? Now, blame Nipgear. When you leave something to a girl like me, who makes the impossible possible, doing this was a cinch. Hey, you have a sister. She did it. Pretty sure Nipgear was the one who made the impossible possible? Yeah. What a blunder on my part. To think I allowed a CPU to get inside of a game like this? Ah! <laughs> Ugh, even my foe is a CPU, you are alone. Servants, gather! Kill her by overwhelming her! Just as expected from a virus. Attacking me with numbers, huh? Goodness! What should we do? Neptune, will you be okay? Yeah! No matter how many there are, they're junk compared to a CPU. I'm gonna reformat their hard drives. <laughs> Wait, all set. Come at me. Yeah, come and get me. Looks like they're intruding. It's my turn. No book boys. Eat this. Disappear. That doesn't hurt. Say. Yeah, you do no damage. That's so <clears throat> weak. There. I've got you. Let's move on. I book boys are book girls. Weak. Such bit players have no hope of defeating me, no matter their numbers. Then I'll just summon even more. Go, go, servant monsters! More. How foolish, facing me! 
Alright. You want it this way? Fine. Have it this way. Is that all? I can't. Is that all? I'll finish this in one go. And you do nothing this to me. Disappear. That doesn't hurt. Come on. Nope. Oh, wait. Alright, I'll come to you two then. And that doesn't work either. There we go. Say. Next. Ready anytime. Yeah. Eat this. And it. An obvious result. Your servants are no more. All that remains is you. Prepare yourself. To die. Time to program fodder enemies. Yo, hey, fodder. But if it's come to this, then I'll spawn my truck card. What's that? I sacrifice my super rare ticket to summon my pre order exclusive DLC item. <laughs> DLC content. W what are you trying to do? Heed my call, super rare monster. Bahamut! <laughs> you summoned another new monster? I'm incredibly lucky to have drawn a Bahamut type. It's the strongest of all super rare summons. Go and kill that nasty CPU! Nah, I'm gonna kill it. Can you handle me? Ready anytime. Mm. Eat this. Say. Uh, I've yep. got you. Yeah. I can't. There. I've got you. Is that all? Eat this. There. Ouch. Yeah, just keep swinging. Eat this. Yeah. Eventually it'll be over. I'll finish this in one go. I've got you. Yeah, too bad it's not one go. Is that all? Yeah. Eat this. I'll that finish does this nothing. In one go. Say. There we go. Fight for a reason. Yeah. Reason is the safety of all games. How can this be? My super rare stuff. How could you beat it so easily? Simple. I'm level 50. You are all that remains, virus. Take this. <laughs> Hang on. Yeah. Bye. <laughs> Goodbye, virus. Phew. It's all over. I'm not picking up any more viruses. Your objective has been met, Neptune! Yay! And I shall dive out of this game. <laughs> so tired. But hey, now there aren't any more pesky viruses in my game. Come on, let the playing recommence. I think you've had enough playing for today. Sister, um, it's really hard for me to tell you this, but uh oh, this ain't good. The game is no longer playable. What? What? What a shame, but it's the truth. Nepgear looked into it, but most of the character data has been erased. Oh, come on, stupid virus. What? That's so not cool. The virus, right? You may have, but that will not fix that which has been destroyed. Damn that virus! This is beyond the beyond of lameness. Come on, cheer up! At least it was only the game that broke. 
Yeah, but now Neptune's gonna have to buy another one. You just gotta get an allowance again for it. Yeah, I should count my blessings that my save data and console are safe and sound. So let's change into our brighter moods and keep on playing. How about a racing game next? I just happened to bring a fun little big one. <laughs> I'd recommend a party game. That plumber just released a new edition of his party game series. <laughs> So would that be for the Mario Party? Perhaps we could tackle an online game together. Okay, that is very vague. You can't you can't say what game that's that's from. <laughs> but it's just an online game. No clue of what it's supposed to be. Oh, I'll go and bring some more snacks and a pot of yummy tea. Yay! Thanks, Nipgear! Pardon me, everyone. What now? Nice timing, Isti! We're out of those dry, crackery things. Can you go get more? I'd rather have something sweet. Why don't we eat the special Lestation cookies I brought? Not a bad idea. But if cookies are on the menu, I would prefer a pot of black tea over green. <laughs> A new pot then. Is them gear basically made at this point? Oh. Hey, quit loafing, Isti. Our mouths demand sugary treats. Oh, wait, it's rematch time. <laughs> hey, don't start the match without letting us know. I'm taking a break. I pity your lack of stamina. I am prepared for another 10 hours of gaming at least. You were always like that. But then again, so was Neptune. <sighs> All of you, the time has come to knock it off. Uh oh, we pissed off Isty. Whoa, why the batitude, Isty? Heavens, my heart nearly leapt right out of my chest. Silence! I must raise my voice. Day after day, you four meet up only to play games. You are CPUs! Well, one is peace, and number two, they're having fun, they're friends! Let them be! How is it proper for the CPUs meant to rule the world to play and lollygag their lives away? They're having fun, leave them! Huh? Isty, are you angry? Like, for real, Seeds? <laughs> now, now, Eastwar! Please, calm down! I will do no such thing! Nepgear, you are party to this as well! Oh, yeah, she is. She's basically the maid of the group. You jump at the chance to offer snacks and tea. You spoil them so much that they do not work! I... I'm so sorry! Oh. <sighs> it is painfully clear that Neptune is a lost cause. But you are smart and serious, so why? Uh. Yeah. I don't really want to go there, she can't just get dragged along with everything. Well, I mean, um, during the last big battle, everyone had it rough, so I thought I'd be really nice. <laughs> Darn tootin'. I mean, even CPUs need to take staycation for a bit. So, everyone needs downtime. Working us any harder has got to be against some kind of goddess labor law standards thing. <laughs> How many years do you think have passed since that battle? Enough! You two, sit down right now! Uh oh. Time out. Today is the day I will pound into your thick skulls exactly what it means to be a CPU! Well, you could at least give Neptune some breaks. She's still got amnesia from the very first game. Uh, that clean. Pardon us, Neptune. I believe we shall be taking our leave now. Yep, definitely. <laughs> you better not give Eastwire any more trouble, you hear me? The wisest one is she who avoids danger. <laughs> uh, no, it's... Whoever flees quickly gets away scot-free. Oh man, they're quicker to run away than...
and I run toward the fridge. So <laughs> lame. Don't abandon me. Well, I've already done that. Silence. Your task now is to listen intently to my lecture. The primary duty of any CPU is. <laughs> oh. Lecture time. Um, well, nice to meet you. Or maybe it's more like it's been a while, everyone. Eastwar's lecture will last for quite some time, so allow me to use this chance to introduce us. With both wall breaking. First, I'm Neptune's. No, no, I'm a big girl now, so. <laughs> I'm Netgear, the CPU candidate of Planetune, and Neptune's little sister. She's Planetune's CPU. All of the CPU's younger sisters have the title of CPU candidate. Let me tell you about them. Oops. Actually, I'll introduce them a bit later. Oh, but the three CPUs who were just playing with my sister are the leaders of the other nations. Noir's from Last Station, Vert's from Leanbox, and Blonde's from Louis. Yeah, we kind of already got that from the intro bit at the beginning. They argue and tease one another a lot, but they're actually good friends. Um, I think. <laughs> yeah, they are. We're currently getting lectured by Histoire. My sister calls her Isti. Yeah, you She's can do that. She's Oracle and acts as our Basilicom's boss. She helps us handle our workload. Supposedly, she's neither human nor a CPU. But an artificial super being that's the world every. Well, of course she's not a human. Because she's so small and she fits inside of a book. And CPU, she was made by a CPU, so yeah. I'll stop myself there. Sorry. I don't really know all the details. Uh so the current game industry is really peaceful. Which is why the four CPUs are always playing around. Before this piece, the deity of sin almost destroyed our world when she was resurrected. Tony Momus. That's not that scary. Neptune and our CPU allies fought really hard for the sake of our future. All I'm trying to say is that my sister and the other CPUs can get things done when they have to. Maybe. And no, it was you and the little ones that did it. Well, in my, in my playthrough of it, anyway, it wasn't your sisters, it wasn't everyone else, because it was only Neptune that was in the party. The other three weren't. Oh well, they did do the final fight at the end, and then seal it away, but... Well, I'm just in. But you, you lot did the main work. Whoops, the lecture's almost over. Sorry to cut off my introductory <laughs> narrative, but I'll finish later. Yeah, better go back to paying attention. Is how all CPUs should be. Let us end today's lesson here. She, she's finally done. <laughs> Ugh, my legs are sawing tingly logs. Can anyone spare me some parallaxin? <laughs> well, wait, Neptune. I can't seem to stand up either. No. How long have you been kneeling? And just how long do you two intend to crawl around on the floor like infants? Well, they said they can't move their legs, so... I want to look at some feeling back in them. But we just said that our legs are asleep! Misty, you talk more than a phone. Look at my cute thighs are quivering like jelly or whatever. Did you learn nothing from my lecture about how a CPU ought to behave and speak? Hmm... No, not really. Yes. You weren't paying attention. Then I assume you have both taken a hard look at yourselves and now understand its importance, yes? Uh... If a CPU has to be honest, I gotta admit that less than half even entered my ear hall. <laughs> oh! Yeah, Neptune, you shouldn't have said that. Shh! Neptune, don't admit to that! <laughs> yeah. If you understand, then get out there and do your jobs this instant, ladies! Ooh. You sleep became pissy. <laughs> ah! Ah! Right away! <laughs> I never thought you would blow 
us out of there with her voice. She was seriously serious, huh? Yeah, I would say that. Yes. If we don't get some real work done today, she might grow even more upset. I guess we gotta. I'd rather nap, but let's hoof it and beat stuff up for a bit. <laughs> You'd rather nap? Really? Well, yeah. Let's step tune. After that, that was, was kind of long. Play games, oh, but I actually been going. Oh, well. Ooh, almost an hour. Let's, you ever seen that is level 10? Oh, come on. So that means you're going to want to focus more with Nepgear than, than Neptune. Let's check weapons. Oh, wait. Do I have to... Okay. Um, have I had weapons? That's Nepgear stuff. Hmm. Yeah, I did. I thought I had weapons, but uh, oh well. But uh, yeah, I'm going to be ending this here, so if you liked it, hit the like button, and I'll see you next time. Bye!